hello 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 my lovely people welcome back to my channel if today is your first time seeing this channel please don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell for new uploads as usual my people as usual i brought to you another baggers booth i mean today's topic will be short and but interesting trust me you wouldn't want to miss it for anything so guys recently nengi peng i mean nengi official the blueprints herself just bought a house so on her instagram she wrote 2021 just keeps getting better with consistency, dedication, and hard work, I finally get to tick this off my checklist. Thank you, Lord, for continued blessings. Can't wait to play table tennis with my friends in my pengi home. Wow, what a congratulations to her. As in, if you read the comment very well, if you try to understand what she wrote, this was amongst a checklist. She has been wanting to have a house like other celebrities because trust me, having a house is better than rent because you can't you, you don't you can't uh, see yourself dealing with landlords wahala like light water when it comes to light water bill or don't keep the house dirty or stop knocking the house stop destroying things you no know landlord with their wahala especially when it's time to pay your rent and you don't have it wallahi that thing is very frustrating oh trust me hmm it's very frustrating during hard weather you don't have any means of income and how to pay your rent. Trust me, you wouldn't want to enter in such a situation. So we are all happy for Nengi for buying this house. So after buying the house, guys, do you know that so many celebrities like Toke Makiwa, uh, Iniedo, so many celebrities were just celebrating uh swanky jerry um you know they we are all celebrating thanking god for this wonderful um house i mean this beautiful house nengi just bought so now it seems like you know nengi fans now i mean the blueprint herself are fans the ninjas they aren't lying low like they want to show off so i think some of them must have gone to Kanya, that means former housemate with Nenge at the Big Brother show. So I think some started DMing Kanya, you know, just to brag a little bit. Then it seems Kanya did not, I mean, that DM did not go down well with Kanya. And she replied. Now we'll be reading some of our response to these very fans that came on a DM telling her that you know whatever they must have told her because i think you know what guys let's just read what she said to them <laughs> i mean i read <laughs> So here is her first response. She said, I bought my home with my hard-earned money before BBM Ninja. No comparison whatsoever. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Guys, did you just hear that? What Kanye said? I mean, that statement she made. Her, I, she said she bought her home even before she went for Big Brother Ninja. I mean, that is understood. And... No comparison whatsoever. She she don't want to compare. Okay, well, we here. And this was a second response. <music> yeah, she quotes. Why you are busy dragging me? Hope you all know social media apps are developed 
on servers. If it crashes today, hope you have a real life also to fall back on. Stop trolling and start building your empire. I be you to no one buy house. Ni ha ha. See cool so like this uh, second response. That is what I like. The first one, I really don't understand what she's saying, but the second one, I love what she said. Because for them start DMing her, trying to, you know, bring argument between her and Nengi, her second response made sense. It really made sense. I mean, that is what she should do. When you see people coming to your DM like that, I mean, fans that don't want, like, trying to make you respond to something or talk, you try to put them in their places. Try to make them understand that, look, you're not competing with anybody and you and this person don't have to be, uh, I mean, to fight. I mean, you guys should be cool with each other. So that second response is quite good. But meanwhile, Nengi can buy a house with her hard hand money. Do you know why? It's because Nengi is an ambassador. So... I mean, her monthly earnings, she can buy a house with it. And other brands, I mean, brand ambassadors she has been to, that she has featured, like being an ambassador to some other brands. So many other things Nenge are getting her money from. Even fans are giving her money, gifting her this, gifting her that. So Nengi can acquire a house. And all these people you see that have houses today, I mean some of them, they didn't buy it like once. I mean using your own money to buy it. Some are bought on installment, like you pay monthly. So let's say for example, uh, they are paying uh, Nengi 100,000 Naira. Um, as an ambassador then this house i mean as an example then this house costs like one million naira and the person i mean the company uh, said you can pay on installment maybe like you can be paying fifty thousand naira every month i mean nengi can do that because nengi doesn't have only one source of income she's so many brands ambassadors okay so if she's getting maybe 100,000 naira from only uh, one uh, ambassadorial deal. So if she's getting like that, once it's time to pay, I mean, monthly, she can pay the 50,000 naira every month. I mean, it's possible. So you can pay 50,000 naira every month as an installment, what they said about that house, how you're going to pay. So anybody can own a house. The most important thing is that you need to work hard and you need to be earning your salary because... Where according to our old people that said now for where man work in the shop, that is why it's called workshop. I mean, where you work, you have to eat. That is why it's called workshop. Okay, so Nengi is working, so she can also afford a house. So, guys, this is all I have for you. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so by clicking the subscribe button. I'll be seeing you on my next video. And nice to remain your girl, Diane Boss. See you soon. Bye bye from Diane Boss TV. Oh,